how's it going? Got a neat shave for you today. Got some new products in. I've been kind of really itching to try. And the soap is Figaro Majeure. Um, it's an Italian soap and it has an oud scent. O-U-D. Oud. And that is also known as agar wood. Had to think about it for a second. And I'm going with my normal kind of staple here. So you know these if you've watched me. Um, but I got something I think fits the Oud fragrance well. And that's the Arco Gold Power. This is supposed to be like Paco Rabanne um, 1 million. It's very close. <clears throat> It's not as deep and it's it's just not as heavy if, if that makes sense. It's just a little lighter, a little sweeter. To me, I think I like it better because I'm not a huge fan of the Paco Rabanne gold. So um let me get this lather going. I'll just do it right here for you. It got a little bit of water in it. Let's uh Alright, I think I got the right amount. Get that going. I don't know if you can see it, the bubbles are big. Get this going. Until the bubbles are not big. Um, well, who was it? I've just answered a bunch of comments on my phone. Don't be mad, I've forgotten who it was. Some of you just have a letter by your name because you don't have a picture. Let me think of who that was. I'm so sorry. I did the five minute shave challenge and somebody in the comments section did note that I kind of cheated. I already had the ladder. I already had the ladder going. I've added water on top of this just a little bit. Get it going a little, a little better. So, this is by, how do you say his name? Chung Fong Sing. I'm sure I offended somebody right there. Or made somebody laugh, right? Bad pronunciation. You tell me in the comments section, do you leave that like that? The lid on? Or do you rinse it out, let it dry, put the lid on? I always kind of get the stuff from around the, the brim here off and close it up. Tell me, I mean, I, I really don't know. This is more of a learning how-to channel than a how-to channel. So you let me know. Alright, let's put this Figaro on. I'm using my Omega Pura, Pura Satola. I figured that would fit the Figaro, right? It's Italian. Much, much stronger on the brush than it is in the tub. Very light in the tub. Nice scent profile right there. Still light, but it did come out a little better. Flinging soap everywhere again. <laughs> and I do intend... I do intend to relax <laughs> and enjoy this shave. That last one was a little ridiculous. That's, uh... Nothing I'm ever going to do again. Oh, and shave twice was not calling you out. I was just kind of making some conversation. I know you kind of alluded that I wasn't, and you're right, I wasn't. Uh, so a little something about this, and I just noticed it. Um, I was watching some reviews and kind of forgot about it, but I, I can feel a little bit of a menthol. There is a little bit of a menthol to this soap. Feels nice on the skin. I do like this brush. Do some
some painting here. Get it on a little thicker. Very lightly touch. That applies it thicker for you. And there we have it. And while the water's heating back up, trying a new product. So my progress here. Okay, let's see. It's on. It's on one, and I always use four, then two. So here we go, Figaro, let's just call this Figaro, what am I going to call it, not gold, why am I just now figuring this out on the camera? Uh, Figaro Majeure, we'll just call it Figaro Soap for crying out loud, simplify things, right? Figaro Shaving Soap, and that menthol is kicking in now, that feels nice. Second use Gillette Wilkinson sword. I just can't seem to get this water hot. I had it hot before I started. There it is. All right, here we go with the, the new soap. Pass one. A more relaxed approach to shaving. <laughs> and it is much nicer to be able to just... Take your time. So I'm going behind this. Not much there. Put some water. Very good, very good. All you need is a little bit of water if you want to go over an area again. That's a good test for a soap. Very nice. And I haven't made it too thick as that rinsed off rather, rather easily. Got my sideburn where I want it. Before trying to mention the the person who said I cheated, I'll, I'll make sure I put your name on the. Well, let's see, where does my, I'll put it over here. One of the sides, I'll, I'll put your name there. Or maybe even up here, put your name up there. And I did, that was, that was technically cheating. But I'm not gonna do that again. Because you can get a lather going in, what, 30 seconds? And then I mean I guess I could get two passes in in a four minute and thirty second time slot, but I don't want to. Well yeah, I could, but you know. You could too, but I mean, it's just it's starting to get dangerous at that point, I think. All right, I'm going to get a rinse and we'll go into pass two. If you didn't notice, I have a black and gold theme here. Black and gold. Black and gold. This is black. The, the, the boar bristles could be considered gold. Black and gold. Wore a black suit with a gold tie yesterday at church. Don't ask. Very nice smell.
I'm gonna look to get that soap cheaper. I don't know if I can. Just add a, a little bit of water to the tip. I was watching a straight razor shave. And the barber was really focusing more so on the lather than anything. And they, of course, they only go with the grain and that's it. And I like my two pass shaves. All right, let's put the sucker on setting two. There it is. My favorite razor. Next two. I guess it would be tied with the Gillette Slim Adjustable. So both adjustables are my favorite. I'd say this one's in the lead just by maybe a razor width. Thickness, I mean. Okay, here we go. Figaro. Figaro Shaving Soap. Pass two. This is far more enjoyable than yesterday. I know I said that already, but I just... I'm really enjoying this right now. But very relaxing. I'm going to have a cup of coffee after this. This is very nice. Trick on the straight razor shave is said stretch your skin as tight as you can get it. I would think those guys really know what they're doing. Doing multiple shaves per day. I'm definitely still learning. I learn something new about this every day. And I, like I've mentioned, like in, I think this is the third shave I've mentioned in my comments section. Someone in my comments section will uh, you know give some kind of a comment that I've something I've never thought to do. Some kind of trick or something. Hmm. Oh, the uh, straight razor shave, the guy, the barber, 
squeezed out about this much out of the brush and applied that to the mustache area by hand because he said he likes to work it in down to the skin by hand and then kind of make it thick like that. Okay, so that soap performed well. I have a good shave. I have a great shave. To the Paul H double chin got mine on sale see that that's what I'm wiping away whiskers all right get a rinse and go into the post shave Very good. Very good. Some witch hazel. Who was it just a second ago told me to try some Thayer's cucumber. Haas, was that you? I'll fix that in the edits as well. Somebody just texted me and while that was paused and uh, the notifications are still on. So if that rings like Sonic the Hedgehog getting a, uh, a ring, you know, one of the rings that he chased, it's gonna be really loud, I apologize. You know what, I guess I could edit that out too, couldn't I? All right. Lotion first today. Yet another commenter whose screen name is escaping me asked me why I did that. No, no, that was Tim Kennedy. I had quite a, quite a nice conversation going with him the other day. Likes to talk about, uh, likes to talk about wet shaving. That's what we're here for, right? <laughs> Okay, well, that feels great right there. Uh, the reason for going with the balm or the unscented lotion first is this Arco aftershave has a very high alcohol content, and I'm awake enough already. So the Arco Gold Power. What do you think? You like it? It's nice. About a one on the burn scale. Nah, came into a two, maybe. That's very nice. Very nice. 
very good shave. This has been my review of two new products, the Figaro Gold Shaving Soap, the Figaro here. Uh, it says Majeur, or, or if you're an English speaker from America, you might be tempted to say Mansour. And then of course the Arco Gold Power, very nice products, and they do fit well together. Very nice. Well, if you're from the States, I hope you enjoyed your Labor Day. Isn't today, what's today called in, in, in uh, the United Kingdom? If they have, I think they have their own holiday today as well. Anyway, I hope you enjoyed your day today there as well. All over the world, I hope you had a good day. I bid you happy shaving, so take care.